Hi, this is your one and only host Eddie Rugby Obsessed Bloke Gardner here, and welcome along to the penultimate episode in this series for the Adidas Rising Sun Pack Review Series. Today we'll be looking at something a little similar to what we have looked at in the past, but it's just a different colorway to all the other pairs from the different ranges. Today we'll be looking at the brand spanking new Adidas Kakari Light SG boots which are taken from the Rising Sun Pack in the also brand spanking new colorway of Legend Inc, Shock Cyan, and Aero Blue. These are as worn by the current Otago under-19 lock for 2019, Cullen Heather, who is not only a great player in my rugby team, but is also a very good friend of mine as well. Even though there are only a few pairs of these boots left at lovellrugby.co.uk under this name, I know now that it's time to get straight into this review because I know you guys will be waiting, so remember to sit tight and strap yourself in, and here's just one last message to my viewers, don't you dare even think about going anywhere. I do hope that you enjoy this review. Let's get into it. What's a better choice to make for a pair of rugby boots for a flanker or a type 5 player than these boots? The brand spanking new Adidas Kakari Light SG rugby boots in Legend Inc., Shock Cyan and Aero and taken from the also brand spanking new Rising Sun Pack, which has a name inspired by the Rugby World Cup for 2019 which is to be located in Japan, the country that is known to be the land of the Rising Sun. The first and most recent time that I ever travelled to Japan was in August 2014 for the NZJPN Club Rugby Tournament, which my first ever rugby team, Most Eel Southland or FC's 2014 squad was part of. The tournament was hosted for three days, from August 15th to August 17th, with a total of 18 matches. Most Eel Southland, however, remained unbeaten thanks to the immense abilities of standout players like myself right winger Joe and Mason and fullback Daniel Johnston. Even though they're long gone, these three days will be forever etched in my memory, to go with my two high school formals which were both held at the Glenroy Auditorium in Dunedin on the 8th of July 2018 for the first and the 7th of July 2018 for the second and last, as well as my graduation assembly at school last year which happened on the, the 2nd of November 2018. Here's more great news, and it's that the former most Eel Southland RFC representatives Joe and Mason and Daniel Johnston themselves are not dead. They are still playing rugby for local Dunedin clubs and previously represented the first 15 last year and the year before at the St. Charles College, who have never played my old school Bayfield High School's rugby teams in their lives. These rugby boots, however, are as worn by Otago under 19 lock for 2019, Cullen Heather, who one day is looking at designing and customizing his own pair. He has come up with his own ideas yet, but he's just not sure which way to go and which point to start at. He probably would choose these in the end. Enforce yourself upon on the game when you lace up a pair of these Adidas Kakari Light SG Rugby Boots Blue. Designed for rugby players at the heart of the action, breaking up play with crucial tackles and darting into key positions these Adidas rugby boots feature innovative super light technology within that provides a great balance between control and speed to help you keep driving your team forward up the pitch. Combine the lightweight tough wearing upper with the low cut sock design giving players the explosive power they need to be the first to the breakdown. Featuring a genuine leather toe box there's plenty of comfort as the power outsole improves traction and acceleration thanks to the combination of molded and metal screw in studs. In a legend ink, shock cyan and aero blue design, these boots are designed for the back row players, numbers 6, 7 and 8. These boots come as part of the rising sun pack inspired by the location for the Rugby World Cup 2019, Japan, the land of the rising sun. Japan was named so as it was the country seen to be the closest to the rise of the sun. The pack is designed for every player who is dreaming of playing at the RWC19, players who are ready to brighten up the game, excite, energize and bring new life to rugby. This pack allows the wearers to make the statement this is who we are, this is where we came from and this is where we're going. Soft ground, SG, for soft muddy surfaces. Make sure you lace up a pair of these Adidas Kakari Light SG rugby boots. Also make sure that you pick up a pair of these great rugby boots from lovellrugby.co.uk for an incredible price of $213.40 and from my online store at rugbyobsessedbloke.co.nz for another incredible price of $199 New Zealand dollars and 99 cents. What great prices these are and they are surely guaranteed not to break the bank. Another great thing from me is that they're 100% sure to look good on your feet. 
Stay tuned as we'll be taking some quick sneak peeks at two differently colored versions of these boots from the previous Adidas Dual Instinct pack. One in high res aqua, shock yellow and core black and the other in core black, shock yellow, and high res aqua. Keep watching. This right here is the high res aqua, shock yellow and core black version of these boots from the dual instinct pack that we previously looked at last year in December. This version is exactly the same as the one that we previously looked at, but just different colors. You can pick yourselves up a pair of these while you can from levelrugby.co.uk for a great price of 154 New Zealand dollars and 88 cents. That's 154 New Zealand dollars and 88 cents. The last few pairs are selling out fast at my online store at rugbyobsessedbloke.co.nz for 105 New Zealand dollars and 76 cents, so be sure to quit whatever it is that you're doing online, even if it's homework, and get in quick, because it is with deep sadness that I won't be stocking them anymore and that once they're gone, they're gone. They look great on your feet and the design would really make you feel like the one who's standing out on the pitch. If I was you, I'd better grab them while you can because it's best not to hesitate when it comes to thinking about buying anything, because if you haven't purchased a pair of these boots before they're gone, and that there are only certain sizes left in this colorway, you'll be sorry for yourself when you find out that you've missed out in the end. The Adidas Kakari Rising Sun Pack and Dual Instinct Pack ranges of rugby-specific boots. Fine-tuned for the forwards, speed, power, control and maximum scrum domination. Adidas Rugby Proud sponsor of RugbyObsessedBloke.co.nz Just before I close this video down, I have one last thing to show you, especially for those who haven't seen it before. This right here is the core black, shock yellow and high res aqua version of these boots from the Dual Instinct pack which you can pick up from LovellRugby.co.uk for 154 New Zealand dollars and 64 cents. This is the version as worn by the Otago under 18 lock for 2018, Cullen Heather. It's exactly the same as the two previous versions that we looked at earlier on in this video, but is just different colors. I forgot to mention that you can also get the option to add an embroidered flag as well for 9 New Zealand dollars and 67 cents, and this means that when I did this with my rugby boots, a pair of the Malice SG in shock yellow, core black and high res aqua that I purchased from Pro Direct Rugby in January of this year, I made them mine. This version of the Kakari Light SG from the Dual Instinct Pack, however, can still be purchased from my online store at rugbyobsessedbloke.co.nz, and the price is 96 New Zealand dollars and 75 cents, but there is strictly limited stock of these pairs left, so get in quick because I'm not stocking anymore, and once they sell out, they're sold out. Enjoy the last few rolling photos of this video, a very good bye for now, and I'll catch you same time, same place, and possibly next week. For our final episode in the Adidas Rising Sun Pack Rugby Specific Boot Review Series, so stay tuned for that, but in the meantime, stay safe, take care, and I'll see you then.